A few months ago, I asked myself, what makes me happy? I've searched the web trying to figure out what brings people to their happy place, and it's proven that being in nature, helping others, and waking up with a smile improves happiness by 56%. In addition, music, animals, and being with loved ones decreases cortisol levels in the brain. When it comes down to money, people with over $75,000 annually are secure and place it last in terms of what makes them happy. According to some beliefs, suffering is everlasting. However, the lack of suffering is what we term happiness. In America, over 40 million people are unhappy, and thinking about something positive improves happiness. I've decided to test that theory, so I've conducted a small survey with the Variety School and Punahou School to see how happy people felt and what they're most grateful for. Believe it or not, the simple thought of being grateful led to a more positive outcome. My name is Arian Kato. My name is Ocean Asato. My name is Cody Figueroa. My name is Victoria Espinosa. Marcus Kaya. I am Jesse Yasuki Brodkin. Marisa Proctor. My name is Kate Lee. Um, my name is Ren Yoshioka. Kate Chikori. Tawani McFarlane Philpott. Maybe an eight. About a seven. Like 100%. Oh, nine, five. Seven? Uh, eight. 6.9. Ooh, today's not a good day. Like a, like a, like a, like a six. I would say probably six. I am firmly a seven. Six, because five is average. On a scale of like one to 10, 50-50. My family, my friends, uh, my pets. Uh, something that makes me happy is going on a trip. Hanging out with my friends and doing things I like to do, pursuing my passions. What makes me happy? Seeing my friends succeed in life or do something good with their life. Number three is my friends. Number four is my good, secure job. And number five is Ethan Lung. Um, my dad, my best friend, my dogs. I'm living here, going to school. Yeah. Where I live. Like my food. Like, like the basic, very basic living things like food and water and like shelter. Um, living in Hawaii, my education, and all my opportunities in like extracurriculars like surfing and water polo. Education, my wealth, and uh, my laptop. Children, my husband, my job, my pets. I enjoy being part of this century and living where I am right now at this time. A lot of things, you know, like friends and family, uh, electronics, you know, like the basics. It went up. It went up? What is it? Now I'd go for an eight. <laughs> okay, thank you. Um, I would say seven. Um, an eight still. <laughs> Probably like a nine. Oh, really? Yeah. Um, thinking about my kids made it go up to an eight. <laughs> Probably at a six still, or maybe a seven. I don't know. I'm a, uh, I'll be, I'll, I'm like a, like a seven point two. Yeah. In a world full of people searching for happiness in life, we sometimes take for granted the problems that other people face. Problems that could be potentially greater than ours. Happiness, by definition, is the experience of frequent emotions such as joy interest, and pride. Although happiness is unique to every individual, we will eventually find a place for ourselves. It is now my turn to answer my own survey. What am I grateful for? Nature, friends, family, and these are my memories. When I